Everybody, any, any pictures you see of Mongolia, all the people are wearing what they call it's a del, and it's like a giant, almost like a blanket that wraps around the body and keeps you warm and everything like that. And it was, it was nice. The lady offered to help me, let me help her make one for me, and uh, so we, we spent some time making me a traditional del. It was cool. I got to sew a little bit, watch her cut it. She, we sized me up, got it all set up. And it was a big deal to them and to me because, I mean, we're, we're foreigners. There's not very many of us out there. So it was, it was a fun experience. It was really, really cool. And it was, it was pure. It was a pure experience. It wasn't, they weren't trying to get anything for it. They did it for free. They did it because they wanted to do it. And that made it more spectacular. My Dell, and she's using an old, it's an actual treadle mill, it's not. It's not no motor in it, so she's actually pedaling it when she's using it. This one's from USSR, as you can see on the machine. Over here, when she has a when she has a uh, wrinkle in the fabric or something, clearly she keeps it on the stove here, and it's warm. It's got warm water in it. It's a heavy. It's not heavy. It's not heavy like some of the ones I've seen in my time, but it just kind of lays down on stuff. It gets the, gets the wrinkles out of the material so it's easier to push through that treadle machine. A lot of material bunches up and stuff underneath those. Very nice. The, uh, our hostess, she waved us over to her, her uh, cabin there and uh, invited us in to see her progress on the Dell. And, yeah, it was, it, we just got to spend a few minutes with the family. Yeah. Yep. Scissor. 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 Yeah. Hatch. Mongolian. Hatch. 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 The fabric is so thick that she has to pull it through, yeah? Because it's not a walking needle, but it's very thick with the sheep felt in here and everything. <laughs> so, she, so we're leaving a little bit on the outside here for the next scene. So down and then back, yes. Mm -hmm. But like in World War One, back in the day before, when they used to only use in the, in the Civil War of America and stuff like that, when they only used to use treadle machines, <laughs> machines that the women who made this stuff, they could go so fast with them. And they make uniforms and stuff like that for militaries and just general clothing for you know, in general clothing mills and stuff. Long before unions, it's the predecessor to why unions were started was the textile industry in America, yeah. And I, I've used treadle mills before and in sewing things, and it's, 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 it's interesting, but it is uh, definitely an art. So you're taking sewing, which is an art, and then you're adding complication to it, which is the treadle, and she came out with a beautiful product. It is absolutely wonderful. My traditional Dell, Mongolian Dell. What a nice thing this is. And this is a this is a spring and autumn one, right?
So we're a little bit long for no gloves, so it covers over, so we can fold it up like this. Nice, we can roll it up, or we can wear it down with no gloves, yeah? But beautiful, yeah? Thank you very much, yeah? Very nice.